but I'll be fixing everything and because there is always something to be fixed I want to show you a failed turbo from a 2 liter 104 horse, 140 horsepower uh, Volkswagen Passat but it's the same for Audi and Skoda so actually this turbo is a Garrett GT1749 VA but it's very similar to the 1749 v and vb i think one is from 110 horsepower and the other one is from 170 horsepower and the difference is actually in the diameter of the hot and cold uh, part uh, uh, intake or exhaust now main thing i uh, had spoken with a person that actually repaired this for a living and according to him something fell off the engine on the inside and went through the hot part and that's how it actually uh, failed the the turbo it wasn't i was thinking it's um, this part of the geometry which actually sits like this maybe skipped or something and uh, it went a little bit too much this way yeah well according to him it's not this that happened i don't know i don't know i really don't know i'm not I haven't been inside the engine to tell you but you can see the damage You can see the sound that was making. I got a video in my channel. Just find, uh, you need to open it through a computer and type turbo in my uh, channel box, search box, and you'll see actually the problem. Um, I'll just try to uh, give it a little bit of uh, assembly so I can I'll just put it on the shelf and you know it will stay there forever but still um, what I wanted to say is that I replaced the turbo still have a video as well I replaced the turbo with uh, with the second hand one that was uh, very cheap actually it was only around uh, $60 I think yeah, it was around $60. So, it wasn't expensive at all. Now, I still drive the car, although he said that something fell off the engine. I still drive the car to this day. Which is strange. But, but I guess it's just lighter. <laughs> With the fewer components, fewer things to break. Very nice. Um, so yeah I have prepared here I was thinking to make a video I actually started it to replace the inner part of that uh, turbo but I can't see no point of doing that anyway I don't want to take more of your time you saw the damage if you have any idea what it is tell me in the comments i'm very curious to know i wish to start selling broken tools as souvenirs huh? this one looks pretty nice Why am I stopping the video? Anyway, I will leave it to it. Bye bye.